Let me introduce myself. I'm Zainab, uh, one of the co-founders of Hasgeek. This is Nigel. Nigel is working with us at Hasgeek, part of the team. And uh, uh, thanks all for coming. This is really great turnout. Navi, what do you think? Pretty good. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> okay. So uh, let me just quickly briefly introduce you to why we decided to do um, the hack night. And then I'm going to let uh, Navi and Piyush sort of lead the way. Um, so, uh, as everybody knows, this hackathon is part of a larger event called the Fifth Elephant. I am Manoj Patil. Uh, I am uh, working in Composite Software Solutions. And recent year, uh, companies focus on change and uh, major uh, uh, focusing areas are uh, enablement, uh, enablement of uh, elastic cloud, uh, big data analytics, and uh, customization of IT. I am heading uh, big data analytics. So I am here to learn something uh, which I may not be aware of or to share something. Hi, my name is Krishna I am from Mumbai here. Uh, I am working in uh, direct type for uh, this and analyzing of I am working as a web developer in the uh, Hi, I am Ankit. Uh, uh, I run a startup called Comparify.com. Yeah. In fact, me with him, Comparify.com. It's a price comparison. Comparify is the key. Comparify. Uh, it's a price comparison engine for telecom services. So, you want to find a good mobile plan, a rate cutter, and so on. So, we actually are from Chennai, based out of Chennai. We are here for a friend's wedding, we got to drop by and meet. We were at the Oh, you got that. Yeah. What's your name? I'm Jigar. I'm CTO of Screen Magic. Screen Magic is best out of like here at offices in Pashan Group. We have an application on uh, Salesforce. It basically sends and receives SMS uh, on Salesforce. So it's quite popular across the Salesforce customers. And now we want to do best out in the social and the advertising. So right now I propose one idea uh, get me an apartment. So basically, uh, Throughout this running a startup, we were actively into searching apartments for ourselves, for our company, and it was kind of search. And we always had to stuck up with the agents. So I want to see the way where I can uh, look out for the various apartments. I, I, I say like this apartment looks good from outside. Can I find the home inside that? So I just post. I want to get apartment in this this building. And Someone who have apartments in those buildings can say like, I have this building and I want to give for this place. So you have to match this thing and get a specific data. So that is kind of idea we have. So if anyone is open to find that. Hi everyone, my name is Nipendra Kare. So I am not ready to do data as such in any case. So currently I have a company called SCEC. They are working with a performance engineer. And uh, and we make some kind of caching solution for Windows, Linux, and other stuff. Uh, and I find a few of the interesting projects here, like one of the 15 watt Sadiq and Belgium, then other one is the giant president who joins the startup, and other one is the movie, uh, movie star. Let's see. Uh, Hi, uh, I'm Salim. I work for Red Hat as a software engineer. Uh, I joined today this group. So I plan to work on Titan with parallel big data processing with Titan with Nikhil Vajjewa. Yeah. So let's see how it goes. Hi, I'm Shreyadar. Uh, I work at Red Hat as a software engineer. Uh, I am kind of a web developer and kind of work, work a lot of heavy things and JavaScript. So I was uh, so I thought I saw uh, visualizations as a part of the entire thing, so I thought I was using Protobis at the time, but now Protobis has been kind of phased out and EC is running I'll be checking out EC today as uh, if any of you have any data which you think you could visualize in a particular way, I don't know if you know and there. Let's, I will look forward to working with that. Hi, I'm Mihir. Uh, I'm heading technology and mobile input Inment Private Limited. We are basically a technology and media company. Uh, we provide uh, in-travel uh, input systems to cabs, uh, buses, and uh, 
and uh, private cars, radio cats, and all of them. So we are expecting a lot of data in terms of usage patterns, GPS coordinates from all the from from the entire fleet. That is why I'm mainly here. So uh, my name is uh, Jaydev Deshpande. I am uh, an intern at Enthought, where I uh, work on the scientific computing side of data analysis. I suggested a couple of, uh, or I suggested one project and there's another uh, socialization project which I'm interested in. Uh, the one that I suggested was uh, uh, the IPTLE ICDM data mining contest. It's a crowdsourcing project hosted by Kagan. Uh, it's, uh, we have uh, the training data set consists of uh, a number of user generated uh, reviews. And we have the task is to match uh, the right product from those user sets to uh, the products in a given catalog. Hello, uh, my name is Kaushtum Sindhya. I am a Ruby on Rails developer. Um, I have worked on an MIS uh, for microfinance institutions. It was a cloud hosted solution that uh, we used to give to microfinance institutions. Uh, I have no idea about uh, cloud computing or so on. Whatever it is, I have read about. No technical details at all. So I am open to any. Ideas if anybody could mentor me or if anybody could just tell me what you work on this project since we are taking up and uh, I work on it. Okay. I am Nikhil Lanjewar. I work with your uh, It's a product startup, it's an internet consumer web product. Uh, I lead engineering effort at your next uh, At your next week, we are building a recommendation engine for uh, early, job, uh, early job seekers. So, uh, the problem we are trying to uh, solve is right now the job market uh, in India. It all, uh, so whatever web products you see like, uh, out there, all they are serving uh, lateral hires. So whenever someone wants to search for a job, uh, you get a lot of results for uh, one year experience or two year experience of uh, work. But the pressure uh, job market is still underserved. So what we are doing is we are trying to build uh, a recommendation engine which considers three dimensions of a user. Uh, one is the social profile, one is the factual information that the user gives and uh, there is some psychometry element to it. So we are combining all that together, uh, we are collecting a lot of data from the user and processing it. Uh, the vision of the company is to improve the matchmaking between uh, an employer and the user. Hey, hello, hello, hello everybody. I am Priyam Chaube. I am a part of Simber City. Uh, uh, I, I just joined Simber City just uh, 10 years ago. Uh, I am sitting here. Uh, I am here for learning some new cool stuff and have, have some ideas what you all are doing here. And let's extract as much as I can. That's all. Otherwise, um, whatever the ideas we are building, please tell us. So, all of us here, uh, <coughs> but we are uh, simversity.com basically. We are an online social learning based school. You can check out the website seminars.com. So, <coughs> what we are planning to do here is not basically pick out any tool or any particular, uh, let's say, last six hours, or a loop, or etc. We're just tools. Uh, we explore, we were working with a similarity and search model for us at our quarter, and we hit a couple of problems. And we realized that just using plain normal tools will not really solve it on a bigger level. Understanding how they really work is, is more important. And uh, to start with, there is a bunch of logs that we get from CloudFront. And there's a, there's a huge amount of log for every per request. I think we're going to start with that. Uh, see what the requests that we get. We're going to store it over uh, some database since we pretty uh, normally use all the databases we have, but we wanted to explore edge base for that. So that will be the database. And choice of language shall be Go, the Go lab. And I don't know whether there's a connector available for edge base or not at the moment. Let's see how it goes up. So that's the prime area. So, Grab all the logs, they are available in GZ. So, you gotta unzip them, push it to a database, and then start analyzing how much, who use what percentage of it, what is the video numbers used, etc. So, yeah, basically, comes up. I am Chinmay, I am a student. I am studying at IIT Madras. I was doing an internship as a person. We have to learn something. Um, I work at University. I'm Kush. And uh, I mostly hack on Python, but these days my first language I can say is JavaScript. Uh, in terms of database and uh, big data, I am very new. As much as that, I cannot tell that when a data set is rightly termed as big data, 
So I am here to uh, get answers to those questions and make some uh, make sense out of my data we have. And that's all. I hope it will be a good experience. Hi, I am Jaydeep. Uh, I am working in the university. I joined Bangladesh uh, Pact, and here I am to learn uh, how associates, how big data is built, and what scale we have to do. Okay. Hi, I am Prathamesh, and I am working for Better Labs as Ruby on Rails developer. I am new to big data. I haven't done anything with big data, but uh, I had proposed an idea of social networking graph, which is like. Uh, you can prepare a graph of different social <coughs> networks and you can plot people on it. Uh, and you can extract the data from uh, different social networks. And it was just an idea, but I don't know how to uh, implement it. So I'm here to learn about how big data works and how I can go ahead with that idea. Uh, my name is Yatish. Uh, I work at Better Labs as a Ruby on Range engineer. And, uh, they uh, better labs basically works uh, into email campaigns, email online marketing, uh, lead generation, B2B lead generation is the main task. Uh, I had suggested an idea of uh, gift recommendation via Facebook. Basically, let's say you got a friend and uh, you want to gift him something or just uh, get his fan base. So basically, you analyze his likes, profile skills, and try to recommend a gift. So which can be attached to an e-commerce system. Basically, this was just an idea that I proposed. Uh, basically, I'm here to learn, and I would like to work on Pratamesh's idea and even the other idea of Twitter to get the verdict of a movie via Twitter. So these are three ideas I was looking for. I'm Swash Patarya. I'm a student at Simbiasis SICSR. We have a deep data mining and data warehousing in the current semester as a subject. Uh, we are learning it with our programming. Uh, hi, I am Nitesh. I am working as a VI developer at Cognatic. Well, most of you would have heard about Cognatic. But uh, I have joined Cognatic this six months back, so I am not doing the cool stuff there. Some other people have been there. <laughs> so, I was basically screwing up. So basically, I was working on very niche technologies earlier, and uh, which consists of a multi-dimensional databases where you can hold some of a, around of like 100 GB of data was very big for me. So when I came here now, here we have like 4 terabytes of data. So that uh, terminology of big thing, but mm -hmm. not again on my mind. So I am here to learn, and I am not here as a geek, and basically I would fall into the enthusiast category, which is uh, <coughs> what we are doing. Uh, hi, my name is Kiran, I am working at Kaviska Solutions as a module lead. Uh, basically, I am expecting a couple of devs. I think they were lost somewhere, so I'm just waiting for them. <laughs> uh, yeah? <laughs> uh, my name is Naveen Kabra. I am a founder of uh, ReleaseCode.com where we are trying to build an engine which can uh, do online evaluation of your programming skills. So we put up problems, you solve the problem, you put up the, the program in uh, different programming languages uh, of your choice and then we will uh, evaluate it, run a bunch of tests against it and then give a score depending on how good your program uh, is. Uh, so I had suggested a couple of projects based on the data we have collected at whatmore.com. Uh, so the first project was uh, Twitter uh, reviews. So on Twitter, there are lots of people continuously talking about movies. As soon as they watch a movie, uh, they send out a tweet saying whether they liked it or not. Many times they set it out even before they have finished watching the movie. So it's a lot of useful data which is not directly useful because it is not uh, collected and automated. As a human you can search and you can get a feel for it but uh, that's not good enough, right? So the question is uh, for, for any uh, given movie, if you search on Twitter, you get all the tweets. Can you figure out which of these tweets are relevant and which are not relevant, which of them are reviews and which are not reviews, then of the tweets which are actually reviews, which ones are a positive review of the movie and which ones are a negative review of the movie.